Supreme Court laid down another landmark decision this morning, this time ruling same-sex marriage is legal. Thanks for joining us tonight. I'm Jillian Furtick. Daniel Wynn has the night off. Missouri was one of 13 states that had not legalized gay marriage yet, but today's ruling requires it to recognize uh, marriage between same-sex couples. ABC 17 Sarah Maslar donor is live at the Boone County Courthouse right now. Uh, Sarah, Boone County started issuing marriage license, licenses today. The recorder of deeds tells me that this morning her office began issuing marriage licenses almost immediately following the ruling. She even had two people who came in the second they heard about the decision. She also told me, she also tells me that they have a couple judges on hand today to marry people who didn't have anybody who could officiate right away, so there were courtrooms available for people. Now, I talked to couples here in uh, Mid-Missouri and Boone County and people today to find out what they had to say about the ruling and what could be next for equality in Missouri. Today's Supreme Court decision came as no surprise to Boone County Recorder of Deeds, Nora Dietzel. Say that you've been preparing for this yes. for a bit. Yes. Okay. Boone County had already updated its marriage application in anticipation of the ruling. We had already implemented small changes in our software, like removing the bride and groom titles from the marriage application and begun using uh, first party and second party in place of bride and groom. She says her staff is ready to give out licenses to same sex couples the same way they would for any other couple. And that's what many same-sex couples are hoping for following this ruling, that people will finally see them as the same as any other couple. Our relationship is absolutely the same type of relationship that any husband and wife have, and that we are proud and celebrate that, and we celebrate the fact that we've been so committed to each other for so long. Many couples feel they now have protection to be more open about their relationships. But to finally have the feel like we have the umbrella of the law and we can you know, be proud of who we are and not cover up and not hide who we are and say, oh, they, instead of my wife or my spouse or whatever. It's a fine day. It's a wonderful day. And while supporters of gay marriage in Missouri celebrate their victory, some lawmakers say this isn't the end of the civil rights discussion. But people can still be fired for their sexual orientation, which I think is wrong. Um, and so I think today is an important step in the journey towards equality, but it's not, we haven't reached the destination yet. So I'm going to keep uh, working for that in, in Jefferson City.